Hey there friends, thanks for checking in at the range. Now today we're focusing on Diamondback Firearms. And let's start right here with the DB9 Gen 4. They came out with this in 2019, the Gen 4 model. Very small, lightweight, pocket carry, single stack 9mm pistol that carries 6 rounds in the magazine. 0.8 inches wide on the slide and 16 and a half ounces loaded with 7 rounds. The Gen 4 trigger measures right around seven pounds, a little bit heavier, but the reset is very short. Three dot sights and a, a pretty nice package they have here. W one of the smallest in the industry, 279 MSRP, and it is plus P rated. Let's go ahead and take a few shots and see how it does. The Gen 4 model also has a slide stop there that is really tight with the frame, but you can use it, which is different than the previous models, as well as the grip texturing. Does have front serrations there, 3.1 inch barrel, priced right, and a neat little pocket gun that is so light and so small amongst the lightest in the industry. And the DB9 Gen 4, they're getting it done. Here we have the Diamondback AM2. I like this gun. 3.5 inch barrel, mags that carry 12 and another 17 round mag. Check that out. It's got black nitride finish on the slide and between the rear and front serrations, a mag release that sits flush with the frame, a seven pound trigger with a trigger bar safety in there, all right, very short reset. Three dot sights, Glock interchangeable, $350 MSRP. And this gun has been great for me since the beginning. Also a serialized chassis, so it is a modular pistol. Let's go ahead and take a few shots. Nice. A couple of those came <laughs> right back. You can see one on my shoulder there. But it's a it's a cool gun. I always like it. it. Breaks down just like a Glock. And I think it's a fine looking gun. Fires everything. Does have a striker fire indicator right there. And the couple years that I owned it, I've really enjoyed it. Came out in 2019. I think they did a nice job with this model sight hole indicator on top of the slide as well along with a pick rail. Here we have the Diamondback DBX 5.7 chambered in 5.7 by 28 millimeter, 20 round mags, FN compatible, under four pounds loaded with 20 rounds, eight inch barrel, Diamondback flash hider, M-lock aluminum handguard rail all the way across, a reversible charging handle, all right, that is reciprocating, you can put it on either side, a, a nice, Firearm MSRP 1125. The brace that I have here is an SB Tactical 19th FS 1913 brace that folds in like that. It does have a 1913 rail on the back, a QD mount. What a nice package! Very thin and lightweight. I, it is really light for a little sub gun chambered in 5.7. Let's go ahead and take a few shots and we'll check this out. Very nice, smooth shooting firearm in 5.7. I love that round. I think Diamondback did a great job creating something this small, lightweight, and this smooth to shoot. The Diamondback rifle that I have here is a DB-15. DMB for Midnight Bronze. That's the Cerakote color. Look at that. It's beautiful. I love this rifle. Now, Diamondback offers many extras that others you have to purchase additionally acsl magpul stock a k2 magpul grip a little more vertical the trigger set at three and a half pounds is a cmc drop-in trigger the handguard is beautiful m-lock does have some nice 
cuts in there see the holes on top uh, it has a rail there for a front flip up sight and a diamondback flash hider i love this setup 16 inch barrel one by eight twist the optic that i have here is a sight mark wolfhound three power by 24 millimeter lens does have a honeycomb filter on there but it's shockproof waterproof fog proof it's a great optic it it has a bullet drop compensator on there all the way up to 900 yards i don't think you're going to shoot a 556 five, at 900 yards but 500 yards you certainly could and would it is uh, set for red or green lumination the dials are really nice I already did some shooting with this. Let's go ahead and run through some of that footage. Black target to the right. Man, I love this rifle. Diamondback does such a nice job with their rifles. They're good looking. They sure do shoot nice. And they offer a lot additional that... You know, I used to have a Colt 6920. I had to purchase all this stuff and add it on. Not with this. Those are the Diamondback firearms that I featured today. Let's recap. The DB9 Gen 4. Here we have the larger AM2. The DBX 5.7, 5.7 by 28 millimeter with an SB Tactical FS 1913 brace and the DB-15 Cerakoted in Midnight Bronze, along with the Sightmark Wolfhound 3x24. Certainly had a good time at the range. These are nice firearms. I, I don't know what the future holds for Diamondback as far as, far as what they're going to come out with next. Nobody saw the DBX 5.7 coming, but they make some great firearms. And I'm actually holding out for a 1911 eventually. I don't know. That certainly would be cool. I, I envision it being a DB1911, but we'll see. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.